of true believers. Just might be the case that some of Mr. Trump's White House staffers just might need a little pep talk. Several White House insiders telling CNN the president's actions lately have left them rattled and feeling dejected. Joining me right now is CNN White House correspondent Athena Jones. So, Athena, what are you hearing about staffers? Hi, Fred. Well, exactly that. This has not been a good week, uh, certainly messaging-wise, for this White House. Uh, you have a lot of uh, White House staffers, especially in the communications shop, who were caught off guard by this announcement to fire the FBI director. Uh, we know that uh, many on the communications team did, didn't learn about it until uh, maybe about an hour before, and so that's the time they had to put together a cogent argument uh, to, to explain the president's decision. And as we saw, uh, we saw shifting stories. We had White House aides uh, uh, telling a story that was later uh, uh, contradicted entirely by the president. In fact, one of those White House officials uh, caught up in this is the vice president, Vice President Mike Pence, who went to Capitol Hill and said uh, seven times in, 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 in talking with reporters over, over just a few minutes uh, that the president was relying on the advice, on the recommendations of his, his Department of Justice. We later learned the president was going to, he says, fire Comey all along. So uh, that's why you have uh, staffers feeling uh, dejected, feeling uh, like they're struggling to, to, to know how to communicate uh, what the president is thinking. And I should mention, Fred, the, these tweets we've been talking about, they're important, though. They're telling tweets, uh, a series of tweets from the president early yesterday morning. Uh, I'll, I'll read you a couple of them. He said, as a very active president with lots of things happening, it is not possible for my surrogates to stand at a podium with perfect accuracy. He went on to say maybe the best thing to do would be to cancel all future press briefings and hand out written responses uh, for the sake of accuracy. That uh, goes directly to this question of credibility. Can we believe uh, that the people who are tasked with, with speaking for the administration, with speaking for the president, uh, have the information, have the correct uh, information to provide to the press and to the American people? Fred? All right, Athena Jones at the White House, thanks so much.